Hello Internet and welcome to Subnautica's top 5 most coolest submarines. Wondering why only top 5? There is still not a lot of submarines in the game and we are anticipating eagerly for new ones. So let's start our top 5 list with position number 5. Seamoth Look at the concept art and choose your most favorite design of the Seamoth. And if it's not 3E, I will have to disappoint you guys that it has already been chosen. From first look, small, harmless, underwater vehicle. You are right. Seamoth is smallest of submarines, but being smallest, he is one of the fastest and the most agile. His top speed is 25 knots, that is equivalent to 46 km per hour. Here you can see interior of the Seamoth filled with high-end gadgets, electronics, and uh, yeah, that seat does not look comfortable at all. Recent patches made it even more better. He can dive to incredible more than 1000 meters deep. Oh, by the way, did I mention that it can fire freaking torpedoes? I assure you, Seamoth will be your best friend for a long, long time. Number 4 is Cyclops, the second very well-known submarine in Subnautica. It is like a portable base in the game. First concept art ever created of Cyclops looked completely different than it is right now. It actually reminds me of those old Soviet Typhoon-type submarines with its simplistic design. Cyclops was changed, and changed for good. I think he looks more aggressive, more futuristic right now. You can throw huge parties inside Cyclops, just look at the diver. He is totally 100% confused what to do with all that space. Number 3. Manta This is awesome submarine concept art. First of all, the size. It is 100% bigger than Cyclops, so imagine what kind of docking stations, constructors, escape pods, equipment we will be able to store inside it. It looks like Manta has some sort of wings attached on both sides. For what? More stability when it's fully loaded? Or maybe that's even more storage space. Does that mean that we're looking at a submarine that is capable of transporting a lot of nice materials from one point to the other? Then again, this is truly a magnificent vehicle and I'm really awaiting for its arrival in Subnaut. Draconis is number 2. Well, this is a magnificent piece of concept art. Everything looks just awesome with this submarine, even the name Draconis. Oh my god, I'm, I'm sorry for my terrible accent. I'm almost 100% sure that this submarine will be implemented for huge underwater battles with huge underwater sea beasts. Nothing is known about this bad boy. Not size, not speed, or how deep can it submerge itself. Maybe the design will change in the future, but at this point it is truly one of the best looking submarines I have ever seen. And finally, number one is... I actually don't know what is the name of number one, but let's just call it Shark. Why Shark? Well, obvious, because it looks like a freaking huge shark. And it is huge. Look at the captain and look at the submarine. Now this is an ultimate party house. If we could throw quite a big party in Cyclops, imagine what thing we can do here. It is massive. It's like a king of submarines. I imagine that you can store Seamoth, Cyclops inside, and maybe even more with right upgrades and modules. I think, without a doubt, that this guy earns himself first place in our coolest submarine top 5 list. Ok guys, thank you for your support on our Subnautica series. If you didn't see, go and check our top 10 biggest creatures in Subnautica. If you like this video, go and smash that like button and maybe we can get 100 likes. 
If you found more of Subnautica's concept art, please send them to me. I will leave an email in the description. And if you want to see another of top 5, please comment here with your suggestion. Thank you for watching and we will see you in the next video.